The Berwick Transfer Station included a second chance shop for years. But the shop was closed in 2019 because it became unmanageable and its popularity caused parking problems. Envision Berwick, in collaboration with the Access Program at Noble High School, has reopened the Second Chance Shop. Access students will staff the shop, which is now open on Tuesdays from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. I'm Jeremy Caston, and I am uh, the chair of Envision Berwick. We are reopening the second chat shop at the uh, at the transfer station it has now been renamed as Envision Berwick uh, loves rebranding and naming things ridiculous names. We have rebranded it Ye Oldy Stoppy and Swappy Shoppy, uh, and uh, hopefully we'll have new signs before spring. And we're very excited. I think. Um, this has been, uh, it's been sad to have the swap shop closed and it's definitely, I think, a, a sign of spring coming and also hopefully the pandemic lifting and um, a way to reconnect folks here in Berwick. The shop is where residents can drop off useful items that are no longer needed or discover old treasures while keeping them out of the waste stream. Sure. Uh, Jessica, her last name is Dapsis and I'm the transitions coordinator at the school. Jessica, will you remind me the name of the program? Yeah, that we're, um, so for Noble High School, yes. the ACCESS program. Access. ACCESS stands for Accessing Community Connections and Empowering Students to Succeed in Life. So it's a program that just started this year where we're working with students in the special education program to introduce them to kind of the world of work, community service, um, so really just get them out in the community so they can see what they enjoy doing for the rest of their lives once they graduate. So it's been a nice partnership. The students will be welcoming people, organizing items, and keeping the shop clean. Really warm, welcoming community out here. When enough volunteers sign up, Envision Berwick has plans to open the shop on Saturdays, in addition to Tuesdays. There have been issues in the past with um, people blocking the shop, just standing in front, grabbing things as people are loading things off, and just general disorganization. So uh, what we did, uh, Envision Berwick did in conjunction with, with uh, Noble High, was to uh, have a meeting with Public Works and, uh, and the great fellows here at uh, the transfer station. I propose having volunteers man the shop so that it'll no longer be completely open with nobody here helping out, but by having folks here who know the rules, they're able to help facilitate keeping things organized, keeping things neat, keeping traffic flowing. Nobody's supposed to be in here for more than 20 minutes but also hopefully creating some excitement around reopening what I think is a great New England tradition. This is such a great uh, community connector and people missed it and we were getting a lot, of, uh, a lot of folks checking in saying when's that swap shop reopening and so uh, it seemed like a, a great way to get involved and to uh, bring the community together and to get uh, volunteers to, um, to help out. To volunteer for the Swap Shop, contact Envision Berwick, which is envisionberwick at gmail.com. My name's Jareth Johnson. Um, and I found this little griddle, a sandwich griddle. Looks like a pretty old one, but I got to find a code to go to it. Hopefully I can find one. And I dropped off a couple of boxes of stuff, a bunch of books and some other things. Hopefully somebody else will like them. Uh, anyway, it's a lot better than throwing stuff in the trash and having to end up in the landfill. That's how I feel. So this is great that the place is open again. The rules for using the transfer station and the swap shop are posted on the town's website, berwickmain.org. Click on Departments and then Transfer Station.